Hello and welcome to another edition of Will's Grill Shack. Today we're firing up the Kamado Joe Big Joe 3 and we are doing a Caribbean pineapple uh, using the rotisserie on it. It's incredible, um, the, the flavours that run through this are absolutely insane and I highly highly recommend that you give this a go. Okay so here is the uh, pineapple, got this one from Costco. Um, it's quite a big one uh, compared to what you get in a supermarket and I think it was only £2 so these are literally dirt cheap to buy but the flavours you get are just insane. So for this uh, we've got the old Captain Morgan spice rum and you want a quarter of a cup of that. Just weigh that out, chuck that in. We've also got the new blend uh, which is mango and pineapple and again you want a quarter of a cup of that. Smells insane this stuff. Quite easily drink a bottle. Uh, then we've got some rum um, and chocolate orange liqueur, which really gives it a nice orangey taste. So again, a quarter of a cup of that. Uh, then just some plain orange juice. and you want half a cup of that. And chuck that in there, maybe just a tad more, just to water it down a little bit. Mix all that up. And what we're gonna do, just cut the roof of this off, just like that. And then you just wanna pop that over the top like that. Grab your uh, mixture, grab a syringe, suck it out, and then you want to aim for the outside, push it in, maybe a little bit tough, and just squeeze down. As you can see it does go, you have to give it a little manoeuvre to get it in. Then you just want to repeat that all the way around. As you can see on here, injected, and now all the mixture is uh, sat in there. So what we do, get your lid, find where the hole was where it cut off, grab two skewers, push down like that. Same with this side, push down like, oh, like that. And then you literally put that in the fridge overnight. Okay, next stage of this cook, it's been in the fridge overnight. Uh, the alcohol smell is insane. So we're just gonna cut the other end off. Just like that. And then, just gonna trim it. Don't worry about it if you're worried you're taking too much off. And you just want to trim off the skin. Then you're left with something like that. Next up you want to get your brown sugar and you don't want to skimp on this and you just sprinkle it over the top and pat it down and do this on all corners of the pineapple. And when you're finished it should look like this. So make sure you cover every single angle because this is what gives it the real sweetness. Then you want to put it back in the fridge for another couple of hours, let the uh, sugar really caramelise on it and then we'll get it back out and we'll fire up the Kamado and get it on. Okay so um, only lighting one half of the firebox today because uh, obviously we're going to be using the rotisserie. Get that nice and light and we'll wait for that to come up to 200 degrees is what we're aiming for. Okay so I've just put the uh, jotisserie ring on um, and I've just settled that up so now let's go and have a look at the pineapple. Okay so here is the uh, pineapple now it's been sat. Um, you expect to get this sort of little glaze here um, and what you want to do is put that all in a little uh, tub so that we can baste the pineapple while we're cooking it. Okay so we're just going up to 200 degrees now. 
So let's get our lovely pineapple on here. Just might want to adjust it so it's more in the centre, just like that. Switch it on. And there we go. Okay, so we're just going to start by putting a bit of this on. This is the uh, brown sugar that's caramelised, so you just want to just put it on there. Just flat it down with a spoon, like so. Don't worry about it if a bits of it flop off. Who says flop off? And this will start to set onto the uh, pineapple and live a lovely glaze, a nice sugary glaze. So we'll come back in another 20 minutes. Okay, so about 20 minutes on now. We've added a bit of cinnamon, so you can see on there, into the mixture. So let's just glaze that again. And we'll put back in another 10 minutes, so I think we'll be ready to go. Just going to give this one more base. Just a little bit of sauce that we've got left. The smell coming from this is incredible. Okay. Here it is, off the grill. Put the glaze on it, it's beautiful. The smell is unbelievable from it. The, the flavours of all the alcohol is just incredible. Okay, so we're just gonna cut this uh, this bit here off because I'm actually gonna make a pineapple uh, upside down cake with this half of it here. But uh, you can just see that there, it's lovely. So let's slice it up and uh, have a try. Okay, now for the taste test of the pineapple. Oh, that is so, so good. The flavors that have come from the alcohol that are embedded into the pineapple is just incredible. I cannot stress how good that tastes. I'm gonna make a pineapple upside down cake with uh, one half of it. And I think the other half is gonna be gone by tonight. So, there you have it, uh, Caribbean pineapple uh, on the Kamado using the Jotisserie. Really, really good recipe, really rate that, 100% give it a try. If you've enjoyed this video, please uh, hit subscribe, like and comment on the channel uh, and let me know what you want to see next. Thanks for watching.